Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Vertex Manoj Roy. Uh, today we are doing enlargement, non-isometric transformation. In our previous uh, video you can see I have done uh, reflection, rotation and translation that was uh, isometric transformation so you can watch my videos. In enlargement, non-isometric transformation the object is going to change maybe the size. Share and stretch were two uh, non-isometric transformation that uh, are not no longer in our syllabus so that's why we are not going to discuss so enlargement in transformation enlargement we require two things the one is the center and the second the scale factor center in terms of coordinates like normally we represent with e the scale factor like scale factor is most important part in enlargement in the scale factor we are having a formula the first formula is the height of the image divided by height of the object. Height means it can be the corresponding height, the corresponding sides, like biggest side of the image divided by biggest side of the object. You can use two triangles or the two shapes, but the corresponding sides will be divide image with objects so get, to get the uh, scale factor. Second formula of the scale factor is the distance of A dash. A dash basically image distance of image from center and distance of a object from center i mean this is like this can this is also possible we are having two types of formula in uh, to find the scale factor or uh, when we require to describe the transformation enlargement as i told you there are four cases there are four cases of a uh, scale factor it can be positive to it can be negative to Positive 2 does not mean only positive 2, it can be positive 3, positive 4, whatever. Minus 2 means it can be minus 3, minus 4 or it can be positive 1 upon 2 means like in fraction, less than 1 fraction and it can be minus 1 upon 2. So, we are having, I have divided this into 4 cases like plus 2, minus 2, plus 1 upon 2 and minus 1 upon 2 and you will 100% understand that uh, what is enlargement and how many cases, how many possibilities are there. For enlargement size and position of the image is always depend upon what the scale factor like plus 2 or minus 2 will give you this where is the position of the image do we have the same side of the object or do we have the other side of the object that's we have to decide and we have to do like when we start our enlargement and I have an example for you with you like for you and I'm going to discuss with an example In enlargement, I am doing the first case with the scale factor like plus 2 and the center I am using here like uh, here, this is center and center is 2 and 2. So what is the first question with the first case that enlarge ABC onto PQR with the given center like center I am using 2 and 2 and the scale factor I am using the first case. And that's very important when you will uh, do these four cases there will be no problem you to use any of the question to do any of the question there will be no problem when you have uh, done these four cases okay the what's the method to do the enlargement that's uh, what we do we uh, write the column vector first from the center to a and then multiply with the scale factor this is very simple method we don't need to use the compass there is also a method but I think so it's easiest method what's the method that from center to the A what is the column vector first of all from center to A what is the column vector 1 1 2 3 like 1 3 is the column vector and I want to multiply the column vector with the scale factor what's the result 2 times 1 is 2 and it's coming 6. This is the position of the image for A. That is P. So 2, 6 from the center, like from here. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So this position is a position of P. If I want to do the, to get the position of B from E, what I will write, I will write first the column vector. What is the column vector from this E to B? 1 and minus 1. 1 and minus 1. 1 and minus 1 multiply with the scale factor. The scale factor is 2 here right now. So your image position is 2 and minus 2. 
So from the center, 1, 2, 1, 2. This position is a position of the image of B that is Q. Now, for C, what we have to do again the column vector. Like sometimes it's very easy without column vector we can do it. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 and 0, you can do it directly, this coming 8. But I am just writing for you. From this position center, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This position is the image of C, that is R. So now when we join these, like when we join, this is the image. Like we have done the enlargement. Okay? Enlargement of triangle ABC onto PQR. That's very simple. Okay. When the case is what? When the K is plus 2, I want to discuss with you when K is plus 2, center. When the object was here, like center, the object was here. What is, where is the position of image? Left back side or the same side? Same side. So I am writing here a link. And this very important. I have to use this. I have to use this. And please uh, remember, uh, just note it down this when K is positive. Center, object, image is in the same side. On the same side. Not in the, uh, like on the other side. So what is happening here when K is minus 2? When K is minus 2, the center and the object, the image will move back side. And that's very important I want to discuss with you. And you have to note it down like we have number of questions in paper 1 that's typical by using this method. So please be careful. In the position of image is back side of the center. So uh, I am going to use second case. And the second case is what? The second case is K is minus 2. K is minus 2 I am using here. This is question number 2. And the center is, again I can use this 2 and 2. There is no problem. 2 and 2. Okay. Now I am working. Like how we can get the enlargement with uh, K is minus 2. Little bit down I think so I require. Okay. Yes. So K is, K is minus 2. I am writing here again. And the center is 2 comma 2. Okay. What's the method? The method is what? That's we have to write the column vector like from E to A column vector and column vector will multiply with the scale factor. What's the column vector? 1, 1, 2, 3, 1 and 3, 1 and 3. You have to multiply with minus 2. So minus 2. This is coming minus 2 and this is coming minus 6. This is the position of your like image when we have K minus 2 and center is 2, 2. What is the position? Check it out. Minus 2 and minus 6 here. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and little bit down. That is coming 6. Okay. From here. From the center. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is the position of like new image. I can suppose this is X, Y, Z. Okay. X from A like triangle A, B, C to X, Y, Z. Position of B. Why like position of B was the coordinate 1 and minus 1. E to B is 1 and minus 1. Was the method we multiply with the scale factor minus 2. Okay, minus 2. And minus 2 will change these signs. So minus 2 and plus 2. So position of the image of B is coming what from here? Minus 2 and 2. 1, 2, 1, 2. This is the position of I can suppose this is Y. Okay. Here. I can use the different color so that it will be clear. This point and this point. Okay. Now. Position of C for the K scale factor minus 2. 1, 2, 3, 4. Like 4 modular minus 2 is minus 8. I can do it. Like what I want to show you. Like you can even do it like this. Minus 8 you can write directly. Minus 8 comma 0. Okay. Minus 8 comma 0, what do you like? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This position is the position of what? Like uh, this is x, y and this is z. When I join these positions, you will have a new like triangle. This is first point. Then you can uh, join this one. I can, sorry. <laughs> this is here. And the third is, 
Okay, we have done it. But I what I have concluded here. I told you that what we need, we should know in case one here. In case one, when the k is positive to center object, the image is in the same side. But in this case, you can see center is here, object is here, but the image is coming here. Are you getting my point? So that's very important. When k is minus two, center is here, object is here, right hand side, the image will be always in left hand side, other side, opposite side. So that's very important in k plus two and minus two. So next, I am going to discuss with you like when the scale factor is what here you can see. The next is I am going to discuss with you about like k is plus one upon two or minus one upon two and what is going to like happen. This is size and position of the image object will be changed. Let's see. So this is the third case we are doing when the k is plus one upon two. This I am using now. Okay. Enlarge triangle ABC onto PQR with the given uh, center and center I have suppose 1 and minus 2. 1 and minus 2. And the scale factor is positive 1 upon 2, please. Now what is going to like happening happen here? We have to discuss here. What the method? That from these two three positions A, B, and C, I have write I have to write the column vector and the column vector will multiply with the scale factor. Okay. What's the column vector from E to A? E to A. What's the column from E to A? 1, 2, 1, 2. 2 and 2. This 2 and 2 multiply with 1 upon 2 because 1 upon 2 is a scale factor. I'm using this first method. Third case, when half multiplied by 2 is coming 1 and this is coming 1. Okay. Something change. Enlargement does not mean this always the size is bigger. Sometimes the size can be smaller so it's possible so this is the position of p okay now i am moving to next part e to b what's happening here e to b was a column vector from e to b 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 8 and 2 so when i do 8 and 2 multiply by 1 upon 2 your result is coming 4 and 1 yes when we divide by 2 this 4 and 1 from the center. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 1 is coming here. This is the position of Q. Okay, then third is E with C. The column vector from E to C is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 5 and 7. I will use one example when the answer is coming in decimal is possible. Okay, 5 half is 2.5 and 7 half is 3.5. Okay, grids are clear. You can write 3.5 and 2.5 from here. 1, 2, 2, 2.5 here and 3.5. 1, 2, 3 and 3.5 is the position here. This is point R. When I join these three points, you can have this point, this point, sorry, then you can use and then we can use this point. So what we have done, that's what what what's the conclusion here actually? Like when the k is plus one upon two, the center and the object, what's happening here? Like what's happening here? What what you can observe here? This is object, image is here, and the center is here, three positions. What are you observing? Image is middle. And object is here. Okay, what's happening here? It means when the k is positive one upon two, center image will be always in between center and the object. That's very important. And one thing, the size will be small. So this is this this was my like I wanted to say something about this. The position is very important in enlargement. Sometimes it can be small. Okay, the next example I'm using the k is minus one upon two. Okay. The k is minus 1 upon 2. So if I use the same calculation here uh, to not waste my time, like the time is important for you actually. So when this, just what I'm doing here, like here, I'm here, uh, all the signs are minus, minus and minus because I'm doing k is, k is minus 1 upon 2. So 
So minus one upon two means what's happening here? I'm just writing all the calculation just to uh, explain like the position here. What two and two will become minus one and minus one. Okay, this is an uh, like when the scale factor is minus one upon two. I'm this I'm doing now this minus one upon two. Minus one upon two multiplied by eight is minus four, and this is minus one. This is minus two point five, and this is minus three point five. Okay, these are the new coordinates for the fourth case. I want to uh, give the position here. Like before that, I have to ch move this question from here. I can write here something here. Okay, now. What's happening here? This part, minus 1, minus 1. This minus 1, minus 1 is what? Minus 1, minus 1. This is the first position. And then I can suppose x. And minus 4, minus 1 from here. Minus 4, minus 1 here. So here. This is y. Then we have minus 2.5 and minus 3.5 from the center. 1, 2, 2.5. 1, 2, 3 and 3.5 is here. Okay? This is Z. When I join these three points, you can see our target is not this part yet now because this was the first. I just want to remove from here. Okay. Now, this what's happening here? Center, object, the image. Position is very important here. What's happening? When we have K is minus 1 upon 2, center like object is right hand side but image is in opposite side but what size is small size is small this is very important part like i have to discuss uh, with you this was my target this we should know when the k is positive 2 or minus 2 when k is positive 1 upon 2 or minus 1 upon 2 what's happening what will be the position of the image and the size also. So finally we have done our topic enlargement and next topic will be that how we can describe the transformation. If you think this video is useful for you, please like my video, share with your friends, please subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon so that you can receive my new videos. Thank you so much and have a nice day.